Hey everybody, what's up? Um, I'm here today in front of the historic but yet newly renovated uh, Lambeau Field. Uh, I'm here today to pick up my race packet. I'm doing a uh, part of the Green Bay Marathon tomorrow. I'm actually doing the 5K. Uh, apparently this is a huge race here in Green Bay. And the cool thing is we start, uh, I'm right in front of Lambeau right now and we start on Lombardi Avenue right ahead of me and I'll do the five miles and then we do five miles, loop around and actually come back. Uh, we come through Lambeau, actually on the field, do a lap on the field, uh, then come through the atrium and then finish out here too. So I guess you have a little chip on your shoe and when you run through the stadium your name gets on the big screen and everything. So I'm really excited to do this. I did it last week. I just hope to finish and I just thought I'd show you guys a little bit about the Lambo while I'm here. By the way, Andy, thank you for the shirt. I'm wearing it today. Only in Green Bay would we have cakes of beer right in front of the sign for the 5K race. Okay, honestly, this is going to be very cool. I just got my chip. There's a little computer chip so Big Brother can follow me during the race. And I got a bag of goodies here uh, that I'm gonna open up right now. My registration packet. And inside it, it came a chip. Apparently I looped this around my shoes and this is how they track me. Here's my number. Here's the design of the shirt. Green Bay Marathon, that's Lambo with the runners, a bunch of other stuff in that goodie bag, a lot of just different types of ointments and cold therapy and this and that, all from the vendors, there's a bunch of vendors there. But the cool thing is one of the people this is sponsoring is the Boys and Girls Club of Green Bay and uh, there's a calendar in there for 2008 and here's some, each page has some original artwork so at least I'll get a few months use out of this. So, some very cool stuff inside the goodie bag. Okay, one cool thing you can do here at Lambo, you can buy yourself or a family member a brick. It costs like 75 bucks and then you're here part of the landscaping of Lambo forever. Uh, I'm looking for the one, my nephew's got my dad one a few years ago. Every time we all come here for a game or just to visit the Hall of Fame or something, definitely make sure to find that brick so essentially uh, we are part of the landscaping of Lambeau Field. Only in Green Bay can you have a full parking lot, a relatively full parking lot, at Lambeau Field on the day of registration. Registration was last night and all day today um, for the race tomorrow. I think there's going to be a real adre adrenaline rush running in on the actual frozen tundra. So this is very cool. Thanks for coming along with me today. Uh, yeah, this is exciting. So this one goes for uh, the Boys and Girls Club, Green Bay, the American Red Cross, and there's one other, uh, I'll put the links on the side what charities this is all going for. Um, so I'm not looking for donations this time, I'm just doing it, I donate a little money myself. Uh, but yeah, this is cool. So uh, everybody wish me well, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Take it easy, bye. Everybody, I just got done with my race. It's Sunday morning, uh, it's 10 after eight. I'm actually home from Green Bay. The race started at seven, I got there around 6 30. Um, it was cold this morning but by the time I got done running I, I wish I would have taken off a couple of these shirts or this jacket or something 
but uh, I finished. Uh, I finished in 26 minutes and like six seconds. I shaved uh, over two minutes off of my time from last weekend. And on three and a half miles, that's pretty good. I was really booking it. I really watched my pacing this time. I didn't shoot out right at the gate like I did last time. Um, I just kept my pace and kept focus on my stride and just I keep imagining my legs moving like a cycle. Um, so I feel good. Right at the end, I started to get a bit of a side ache. <clears throat> But right at that point, they entered us through the player's tunnel of Lambeau Field where the Packers actually come through, and we ran a whole lap on, on the frozen tundra. Um, that was absolutely amazing. They had a little cheering section there for us in the bleachers. And uh, like I said last week, I felt like a rock star. I mean, I just felt like somebody, you know. Um, so very cool. And then, you know, you get out of the stadium, and there was the finish line within a few feet few yards you know maybe 100 yards something like that so then I was able to book it and and uh, just book it right in there so yeah I finished I'm very proud of myself I'm very proud I did this and I finished better than I did last week even though the conditions weren't as good it's a little bit colder today um, there were like eight almost nine thousand people doing this but this included the marathon uh, at half marathon and the 5k and I did the 5k next race is a month from now in Green Bay there's a Bellin 10k run that I plan on doing so we'll see uh, if I can do this I can do I can double it I actually got the results online I probably could have got them an hour ago since it's all through that computer chip um, out of 1,679 male runners I believe that's just the men for the 5k race I was number 216 um, I did the math, and that's 12 in the top 12.8% of the race, which is pretty cool. I redid my math from last week, and I was like in the top 13 or 14% of everybody running, of all 5,000 people, adults, children, walkers, runners, etc. This was just uh, number 216 for the men uh, out of the runners on the 5K. That didn't include anybody under the age of 16 or 17. Um, so I'm pretty proud of myself. My final time, according to the chip, was 26 minutes and 4 seconds. Uh, that comes out to just a tick over an 8 minute mile. So last week I was at a 9 minute mile, so I improved that very much too. So I'm pretty proud of myself that I was able to, you know, be number 216 out of a few thousand people. Um, considering I'm just an amateur at this running at home, I need better shoes, I need better equipment. So yeah, that's pretty cool. So that's all for now. Talk to you guys later. Bye.